Look, gambling addiction is a serious issue. It's not just about losing money, it's about losing control. It's about the lies, the deceit, the damage it does to your life and the lives of everyone around you. We need to talk about this. We need to understand it, because the sooner we recognize the signs, the sooner we can get help. This isn't about judging, it's about understanding. It's about getting real with yourself and taking action. We're going to break down the stages of this addiction, from the initial thrill of winning to the devastating depths of despair. We're going to lay it all out on the table, no sugarcoating, no excuses. The goal here is to shed light on this issue, to help you recognize the warning signs, and most importantly, to encourage you to seek help if you see yourself or someone you love struggling with this. In the beginning, it's all about the wins, the excitement, the rush, the feeling of being on top of the world. You win a few hands, hit a lucky streak, and suddenly you feel invincible. You start to believe you've got a system, a secret weapon against the odds. You tell yourself it's skill, not luck. You start chasing that feeling, that high, and it becomes addictive. The wins fuel your confidence, making you believe you're in control. You start to rationalize your behavior, telling yourself it's just a bit of fun, a harmless hobby. But here's the truth, the house always wins. It's designed that way. You may have some early wins, but they're just bait, a way to lure you in deeper. Don't be fooled by the initial rush, it's a trap, a dangerous illusion that can lead you down a dark path. Then the losses start to pile up. The wins become less frequent, the stakes get higher, and you find yourself chasing that elusive feeling of victory. You start to gamble more frequently, trying to win back what you've lost. You tell yourself you'll quit once you're even, but that day never seems to come. The losses start to affect your mood, your relationships, your work. You become irritable, withdrawn and secretive. You start to lie to your loved ones, hiding the extent of your losses. The guilt and shame start to weigh on you, but you can't seem to stop. You're trapped in a vicious cycle, chasing a dragon you can never catch. This phase is critical because it's where the addiction takes hold. The losses fuel the obsession and the gambler becomes desperate to regain control. Now the gambling consumes your life, it's all you think about. You're willing to do anything to get your next fix, to chase that elusive win. You start borrowing money, maxing out credit cards, even resorting to theft. The lies become bigger, the desperation more intense. You isolate yourself from friends and family, ashamed of your actions and afraid of being caught. You're living a double life, consumed by guilt and fear. The consequences start to mount financial ruin, broken relationships, legal problems. Your life is spiraling out of control and you feel powerless to stop it. This is the darkest stage of gambling addiction where the gambler is willing to risk everything for a chance to gamble. Eventually, you hit rock bottom. The consequences of your addiction become undeniable. You've lost everything, your money, your relationships, your self-respect. You may face legal trouble, health issues, even thoughts of suicide. The pain is unbearable and you're forced to confront the devastation you've caused. This is a critical turning point. It's the moment of truth where you have to decide, continue down this destructive path or choose to fight for your life. Hitting rock bottom can be a wake up call, a chance to break free from the chains of addiction. But it's not enough to just hit bottom, you have to choose to climb back up. This is where the real work begins, the journey of recovery and rebuilding your life. Admitting you have a problem is the first step towards recovery. It takes courage to acknowledge the addiction and its devastating impact on your life. Reaching out for help is not a sign of weakness, but a sign of strength. It means you're ready to fight for your life, to break free from the grip of gambling. There are resources available, people who understand and want to help. Therapists, support groups, addiction specialists, they're there to guide you on the path to recovery. Remember, you're not alone in this fight. Many have walked this path before you and they've come out stronger on the other side. Seeking help is a crucial step towards taking back control of your life. Recovery is a journey, not a destination. It takes time, effort and commitment. It's about rebuilding your life brick by brick, day by day. You'll learn to cope with triggers, manage cravings and develop healthy habits. It's about finding new sources of joy and fulfillment outside of gambling. Support is crucial throughout this process. Surround yourself with people who understand your struggles and encourage your progress. Remember, there will be setbacks along the way. It's part of the process. The key is to learn from them and keep moving forward. Recovery is about regaining control of your life, your choices, your future. 
It's about rediscovering who you are and living a life of purpose and meaning. If you recognize yourself or someone you love in these stages, please don't wait. Reach out for help. There are resources available, people who care and want to support you on this journey. Remember, you are not alone. This addiction is powerful, but so is the human spirit. You have the strength within you to break free and reclaim your life. Take that first step, reach out and start your journey to recovery. There's a brighter future waiting for you, a life free from the chains of gambling addiction.